The U.S. men's national team thinks that they've qualified for the World Cup. Uh, the only problem with that is that they haven't qualified for the World Cup. Sure, they are up by a lot on goal difference here, but not only is the fourth place team still just three points and one game behind us, but they're who we play next. Not only that, but the last game is away at Costa Rica. So Costa Rica with nothing to lose is absolutely going to throw everything that they have at us. It's not like we've ever seen teams in CONCACAF almost get six goals in a game or something. And it's not like we've ever been stomped by Costa Rica before. As a matter of fact, we actually have never won a World Cup qualifying match in Costa Rica. Ever. I mean, I don't want to get too upset at this banner. I don't want to be out here getting toxic. But let's put it this way. Could you imagine a Premier League team bringing out a banner saying that they won the Premier League when they still had a game left? And that game was against the team trying to catch them? Now, when the banner came out, the players didn't really know what it said, and they actually didn't even know the result of the other game, so many of them thought that they had already qualified. But when some of the coaches who did know the score from the other game and knew that we hadn't qualified came out and saw that banner, they made sure to get rid of it really quickly. Leave it to the Federation to put just ridiculous amounts of pressure on our team for a game that shouldn't have any whatsoever. And also at the same time, make them look like complete assholes. Well done to whoever brought out the banner. Just well done. Maybe the person who brought out the banner just know something that we don't. Maybe they know of the Federation's plan to forfeit the match against Costa Rica. That way it's only technically a 3-0 loss, only a minus three on goal difference, and that's a 100% win con to the World Cup, baby. US Soccer Federation, 100,000 IQ as always. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you have not already, I would recommend that you click the subscribe button, especially if you made it to the end of this video, because that means you probably like it a lot. And if you liked this one a lot, then you'll probably like the next one, and the one after that, and the one after that too. So don't do it for me, do it for you. Just click subscribe. Thanks for watching, and deuces.